In 1944, during World War II, a 21-year-old British flight sergeant named Nicholas Alkermaid was returning from a bombing raid with his team when they were suddenly ambushed by enemy aircraft. Although the pilot desperately tried to escape from the enemies, the plane's fuselage was hit, causing it to catch fire. And once the pilot realized they were going down, he quickly ordered everyone to grab a parachute and jump. But when Nicholas went to get his parachute, to his horror, he realized it was burning and no longer worked. Since there were no extra parachutes and the fire was spreading quickly, Nicholas knew this had to be the end. Not wanting to go painfully in the flames, he forced himself to jump, hoping that would make things quicker. But after falling 18,000 feet to the ground, he woke up and he was still breathing. Turns out, Nicholas pretty much had a perfect landing, with soft pine trees and snow completely breaking his fall. What's crazy is that he was barely even injured, he only had a sprained leg and a couple of cuts. When the Germans found him and interrogated him, they thought he was completely lying until they found his crashed plane with all the details checking out. Before they sent him to POW camps, the Germans gave him an official document certifying his claim, since they said no one would believe him after the war. He survived those camps and went on to live for 47 more years.